He spent five years working in the Trade Center complex and was in the basement of Tower One when the first plane hit, sending a fireball down the elevator shaft 10 feet away. All of a sudden, the whole floor, the whole building just rocked. It just rocked and threw you and just threw you. You didn't know what happened. I get up. And all you hear, and all, now all you hear is, now, now you feel is heat. You hear heat. It blew, it, now it blew me into the, going into the doors of the parking lot. Then all of a sudden the heat, and it just came blowing through. And the heat that you felt was so terrible. And, and, the, explo and, and the, the explosion that happened, it was knocking down the walls. The ceilings were falling. The, 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 the block walls were caving in. Steel doors. Steel doors just looked like paper. Then there's silence. Then there was si all there was was silence. And then after a couple of seconds, you're getting up off your knees, and all now you hear silence, and it's a dead calm of dust and smoke. And all of a sudden, you hear people slowly. Somebody starts screaming. Someone starts yelling. Someone starts saying, "You're hearing, you're hearing help. You're hearing please. You're hearing very one at a time. You're hearing it." And, and, and people you see burnt and everybody's hurt and you're just getting and it's smoke and, and, it's, and you're just going over the building too. And you just feel like you're just going to get up and just, I know the building, you just feel like you're just going to get up the staircase, everybody's going to go up the staircase and leave. All of a sudden, here we go again, building two gets hit. I couldn't get into building two, if the doors, nothing would open, nothing would open. It just felt like something like compressed all the, it, it was strange, it was just you couldn't even push doors. We're running up the ramps and... Things elevate. You hear elevators coming, screeching. It's like a, it's like a missile coming towards you. When you hear a 10,000 pound, 20,000, 40,000 pound elevator coming down the shaft. Now I don't know what that is. I just think now you're getting invaded. You're just being invaded. There's everything's just coming at you. The world is coming to an end. You don't know what's going on. You just keep hearing these things shooting down the shaft. You're hearing people screaming. Then all of a sudden you don't hear them screaming. You know the wall. You know they just died. Whatever was over there just died. It was just silence. And then we come running up and down. We're running up and down the ramps because there's ramps and there's long runs. And then finally, I, we, we, we finally see a panic door. We're coming outside, and it's the, it's the West Side Highway. People are everybody screaming. No, no, you don't even know what the – you have no concept of what's going on above you. All I know, I'm just speaking for what I know, is there's 110 floors above my head that all you see is people that – you don't know, but they jumped, people that jumped. And you're seeing pe uh, people that things happen to, crushed cars. You're, you're seeing everything that have flames of fire coming down. Now you're saying to yourself, you know what I mean, do you stay here or do you just make a run for it? You don't even know what the hell to do. And we, we're all, we all made a run for it, and all of a sudden we're running down the West Side Highway. And now you, you think you died three times. Now all of a sudden you're out on the West Side Highway after all this is over, and then people are screaming, the building's coming down. And then all of a sudden you feel the rumbling of the floor down the West Side Highway. You just think you, you just think it's gonna something's gonna fall on you. You just think you're gonna die. I still cannot believe those two buildings are not there. I that day when I saw dust, I I was hoping to God when that dust was over, I was hoping to God that buildings were still standing there. And I stood there until the dust, you know what I mean. But then all of a sudden the dust started going one direction, but it started going the other direction. And we were full of dust, and we were crying, and, and all of a sudden the buildings weren't there no more.